for all over, all over time, right? So, so, Crow Walk would be the worst. Start there. The year was 1204 of the Septian calendar, and all across Erebonia, spring was in bloom. At the esteemed Thor's military academy, situated on the outskirts of the Imperial capital, a new class was founded. It would be known as Class 7, and was comprised of nine promising young men and women, who demonstrated considerable aptitude for Arcus, a sophisticated new type of battle ordnance. Everybody get that. Reen Schwarzer. Son of a ruling lord from the remote region of Rhineford, daughter of the chairman of Erebonia's largest industrial corporation, boy who harbored dreams of becoming a musician. A renowned military family tracing its lineage back to the knights of old. Machias Regnitz, the son of Heimdall's imperial governor. Everyone, even in Gotta, you gotta know this because played Persona 5, I'm pretty sure. Emma Milstein, the, the class's president Everyone and the Academy's one, highest one, scorer on one. the entrance exam. And, you know, you not until you learn the story, you play the game, you went for the best girl, which most people believe is Makoto, which I kind of to that. So, in this one, I'm saying best girl. Yusis Albarea, son of Duke Albarea, head of one of the Empire's four great houses. Fee Clausel, a former Jaeger with extraordinary strength and agility. And Gaius Warzel, an exchange student from the land of Nord, bordering the Empire to the north. Gathered together by their homeroom teacher, Sarah Valestine, they were put through a difficult trial. Some were quick to work together, others less so, but eventually Hello, all Jonathan. were able to surmount the challenge they faced. Wish my teacher was that hot. <laughs> they were then asked to decide whether, knowing the difficulty of the curriculum, they no still wish to be game. part of class of seven. Trunk. Gerd. Trunk Gerd. Each had his or her own reasons, but each ultimately heeded the call. And that day, Thor's newest class. At the close of September, Class 7 was summoned to Valflame Palace in Heimdall. There, they were to be recognized for their bravery at both Gorelia Fortress and the Saxon Iron Mine. It turned out their presence had been requested by none other than the Emperor of Erebonia himself, Eugent III. They were granted an audience with him, Empress Priscilla, Princes Olivert and Cedric, and Princess Alfie. During their visit, they also encountered Chancellor Osborne and Governor Regnitz, as well as the heads of the four great houses, Dukes Alborea and Cayenne, and Marquis Ragnar and Hyar. Uh, 
and none other than Karen, the main who up. Went by the special train, both by the evil car from the last day of the show, and soon they found you there with the globe ball When I got in there, they were shown to the Phoenix Bay and get them in where they would stay. Put their belongings in their rooms, then held a meeting to figure out everyone's roles in the concert for the Academy Festival. Somebody, what is up? Kind of giving everybody a little bit of an overview. Brother, brother, blah, 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 blah. They should put voice overs for the rest of this. <laughs> I, well, I told you, my man. I told you it was going to be quick. I told you that you only had, like, less than an hour. Whoa. <laughs> You thought I was joking? You were right where I thought you were being. Alright. Alright. I may hear you. Now, I'm trying to give everyone a little bit of an overview for the music, like I am just... Giving everyone the rundown of who the characters were, which I just did. So... Without further ado, guys, I've been told just to skip through, oh, skip through all the the monotonies and uh, go right to the gameplay, which I'm going to do. I had to transfer some of this over to to uh, just to get the gameplay started. Same on my bonus content. Not really. So, anyway, I'm out of place called Eyes of the Heart. This and stuff's now gotta be forward. around here somewhere. My weaponry. I can sense monsters nearby too. I'm gonna need to be careful. My turn. Let's move. That's that. Let's keep moving. Yeah, I guess the breakfast looks pretty upscale since. <laughs> oh, you call that dinner? Really, P? I don't know if I want to be eating them, them type of people collies. They kind of look like silverfish. I can 
to find out. If I keep going this way, I should be able to get out of the canyon. Excuse me! You can't seriously be thinking of leaving him there out in the open, are you? <sighs> hey, say something. Are you mad at me or something? Why would I be? You only completely disregarded and overruled my decision. <sighs> what else was I supposed to do? If we hadn't flown away when we did, you'd be dead by now. <laughs> you probably would have lost Valimar, too. If anything, you should be thanking uh, I me. I can't agree with you, Selene. So shut your ass <laughs> up. Uh, that's my boy. That's my boy B got, ladies and gents. <laughs> he's he's telling you now I'm gonna know your place. Forget it. But you know, cats don't really obey like dogs do. You know that, right, B? Right now, I wanna focus on finding the others. If I keep going this way, I should end up Sorry, but that's a huge waste of time. It's been over a month since all of that stuff happened back in Trista. A month? You can't be serious! There's no way it's been that long! <laughs> yep, I'm pretty sure it's taking sure, the grip of a cat. A cat would be more likely to scratch your, and snatch your eyes out than, than he is to a pig. Like I said, you and completely you remember, exhausted yourself what during your first synchronization with the Ashen Knight. Earth natural a-holes. And I do mean completely. There was a real chance you could have died. What? Huh? It's a miracle you're able to walk Not around like this a mere month later, damn, and it's all damn, thanks to you, him. You say I get broke sometimes? He used what little mana he had left to and just so you know, uh, I've been here this whole time, watching nice, over man. you. Damn, shotgun to the butt? Really? Yeah. Wow. That's so I really don't think I deserve think. all of this animosity I'm getting from you. I... This can't be. It's been a whole month since what happened near Trista. But then... What happened to the others? Straight through the pooper. Really? Wouldn't you just prefer just to like, you know, I don't know, maybe put like hot pepper on the pooper? It'd be a lot, it would be a lot more, uh, how do you say, painful? Hey, it would be for a while. Bang, bang, dang. I get to the, the, the red pepper to the booty. Just, just, it's a lot more interesting. Especially when they try to crap all over the oh, yard. For heaven's sake! And they try eh, right up in the pooper. Although, <laughs> well, you're not talking about a scratch, my man. You're talking about a full, a full on cascade hemorrhage. Activate. Yeah. 
my turn. Disactivate. Huh. That's that. Let's keep moving. Cortisone too. Damn. <laughs> They're gonna keep the cortisone too. Uh, there ain't no leeway with you, is there, B? They either shape up or ship out. <laughs> or in your case, ship up or get blasted. Calming down a little, you know. <sighs> <sighs> you could at least respond. Ha! Shut up, you shut up, Selene, you dang cat. No one cares. Damn, stick it, stick it, dynamite. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I wonder what she did to piss you off. Just talk by talking. moving. Let's move. Sit. Got it. 
My turn. Sit. My turn. Ha! Here I go. Ha! I need to make up for lost time. I had a level 4 here. Oh, well, beyond level 4, really. Just to even start on the group. I know you're wondering why I'm wearing a way. There's a reason for that. See when he's knocked out? Enemy inside. Let's move. And then give me a level 4. Time to kill move. Let's move. Let's move. Here I go! Ha! I need to hurry and find the others. Oh, this is stressful. Yeah, the music's not too bad. That tarot bomb's definitely gonna come in handy down the line. Call me crazy. Don't open your mouth, don't open your mouth. Damn it, she opened her mouth. <sighs> I'd asked this before and didn't get an answer. Probably because I was bombarding you with question after question. But better late than never, I guess. Just what are you anyway? Why do you know so much about everything? And don't even think of saying you're just an ordinary cat. Because last time I tried talking to a cat, it did not talk back. Oopsie! <laughs> totally forgot about that, didn't I? I'm what you'd call a familiar. I faithfully serve the witches of the Hexen clan and aid them in fulfilling their duties. Witches? As in the witches in Erebonian legend? First the Great Night legend turns out to be based on a true story, now this? I feel like I've stepped into a fairy tale. That or you're smoking some Well, you know what they say. Truth is stranger than fiction. Whether you believe me or not is up to you. I'm not going to try and convince you. Oh, I've got no real reason to doubt you at this point. So, do you serve Emma then? Rather, does that mean she's a witch? She's still a novice, but she is a witch, yes. My job's more to keep an eye on her, though. I did always get the sense that there was more to Emma than meets the eye. Yes, we were right. But her being a witch? It's surprising. But then again, the more I think about it, the more it makes perfect sense. <laughs> hmm? What's with the goofy grin? Oh, it's nothing. Anyway, let's get going. Find the others.
Ready to go? Here I go. Second form. Gale! I need to hurry and find the others. What is this guy? I hope everyone at the academy Forgive me, saved forgive me, little chimp. I got a little girl who's now very nosy. Not to mention Elise, Princess Alphen, and Prince Oliver, too. Are you sure that's a puppy? Yeah. <sighs> yep. Take a deep breath and keep calm. I can start figuring things out once I get a little farther down. And I guess you can't say that. Time. But she's also just a little nosy. Get out of my way! Let's move. Burn to ash. Fall! Here I go. Need to make up for lost time. I need to get my strength back. Hurry and find the others. Oh, this is stressful. Here's a boss battle. Could it be? Always a boss battle on certain things like this. I'm almost home free, and then something else pops up. Been 
here before. Master Kafai brought me here as part of my training. That's the name of your former instructor, right? Yeah. He was the founder of the Eight Leaves One Blade School of Swordsmanship that I follow. His full name's Master Yun Kafai, though most just know him as the Sword Hermit. years ago. In fact, if I remember right, my hometown of Ymir is only a few hours away. There by sundown. If we hurry, yeah. As soon as we get to Ymir, I want to try and gather information on what's been going on. What was that? It feels like it's coming closer. It couldn't be. That sounds like a beast. Oh, hell no. I totally forgot about this game. It's a magic knight! You know what that thing is? They're magic golems made during the Dark Ages, and they're incredibly strong. Damn it, what's one doing here? Ugh, we need to get out of here, now! You don't stand a chance against it on your own. Maybe not. But that's not going to stop me from trying. You idiot! You're still recovering! You don't stand a chance! We'll see about that. All I know is that it's standing between me and everyone I care about. So if getting to them means taking this thing on, so be it! Unbelievable. Shit, yo. your feet behind the book. Bring it on! Let's move! Burn to ash! Fall! Too slow! Let's move! Putting a dent into it. Ugh. We're so close to you near too. I told you this would happen. Get back. So 
すごいね<笑> I can't lose. Not here. Not without seeing everyone again. Don't be a little bitch, Bean. Elisa! Not today, buddy! Uh, are those arts? Yeah, but where... See you later! Cross Crusade! Made it without a second to spare. Good to see you're still in one piece. I'm so glad we hurried. I don't want to even imagine what could have happened if we weren't in time. You aren't hurt, are you? Your Highness and Dovo and Rain, stay right there. Exhausted. Who's she? Louise. It's really you. I feel like I'm dreaming. I never would have expected you to come all the way out here. Rain, please! There's no need to speak right now. Save your strength. We'll take you back to Ymir just as soon as we've seen to your injuries. I'm just so glad you're alright. But how did. You know I was here. As my consciousness began to fade, I heard a distinct voice resound at the back of my mind. A voice with all the gravity of steel, and yet a strange sense of familiarity, of warmth. And as I listened, I could feel myself being beckoned towards the Wheel of Fortune. Dost thou desire the power? Think so, huh? It's uh, it's not like your Final Final Fantasy 15 now. It it, it is turn turn based and it is kind of strategy based. But you know, if there you ever need help on some, there are walkthroughs out there. They don't have an official walkthrough out there. Some of this stuff that I when I when I first played. Oh, nice. Um, 
because these are just coming out for the PS4, there's a lot more voice acting in, in certain areas than it was in the original. Um, I, truth be told, I haven't completed part two, because you know, other games kept popping up, and it was originally for the PS3 and the, and the Vita. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I was a little happy when I found out it was coming up to the, to the PS4. Happy to easily jump, because I'm able to jump back on and off at any time that I want. It's uh, best that way. Especially with a PS4, and then it also gives you, if you forget what you're doing, it does kind of give you a little bit of a tidbit or a, a look back on what you do or what you did accomplish, so. Mm. I, I, mean, I like the story, no. I mean, if, you, if you're into Japanese anime and Japanese RPGs, uh, I definitely would recommend it. Um, it's one of those sleepers, really. There, When I first found the game, I was... I, I found it on accident, so... <sighs> but I was pleased with the outcome. Celine, this looks just like my room. I knew it. I'm back in Ymir. I'm finally back home. My memories are kind of hazy now, but I think that means everything that happened in the mountains. <sighs> Why did it get so cold all of a sudden? Oh, you finally woke up? Yeah, just a second ago. How about no, you? Sir, I, I was high. Feeling better after a cat nap? <laughs> Didn't get to work because I was high. Hmm, I guess. I slept more than I meant to, actually. You're awake. Elise! Um, good morning. Actually, it's probably closer to noon now, isn't it? <gasps> Elise? Oh, I'm so happy that you're awake! You don't know how scared I was! There was all the chaos in the capital, and then we lost all contact with you! We had no idea where you were! I'm just so... so relieved! I'm sorry. I'm sorry for worrying you so much, Elise. <laughs> no. No, you don't need to apologize. I knew that somewhere out there you were alright. And that you'd come back safe. Welcome home, Reen. It's good to be back, and thanks. <laughs> I see our two little lovebirds are as twitter-pated as ever. P pardon Good morning, Reen. And to you as well, Elise. Hey there. Just swinging by to see how you're holding up. You're here too, Your Highness? I'm really not dreaming then. Oh, you're so silly, Reen. I would have thought the warmth of your dear sister pressed against your chest was proof enough of that. Y your Highness, please! <laughs> well, I'm just glad you're up. How are you feeling? Still sore? You've been fast asleep since we brought you back here yesterday. I don't have any serious injuries, at least. But I doubt I'd be able to say that if you hadn't come when you did. Thanks, Toval. I suppose I owe you my thanks, too. That art of yours didn't come a moment too soon. <laughs> You're both very welcome. I just didn't want to give these two young ladies anything to cry about. Aww. I see you're finally up. Dad! Mom! Hello, Reen. It's wonderful to see you back home. I imagine you have plenty of questions running through your mind, but first and foremost is getting you something to eat. We can discuss what to do from here on out after that. That's new. In the original version, they didn't have any voice actors for his mom and mom and father, so I'm a little surprised that they actually went ahead and put that in there. 
So that's definitely new. Well, they did say they were going to add some more stuff in there. Did. Well, people, if you like what you see, you know, click like, subscribe. I'll probably do more, some more of this. They might be in, be in a good place to make up a bait and uh, bring it to, I mean, I wouldn't mind to.
there was uh, an anime movie called uh, Legend of Hero, Legend of the Legendary Heroes, uh, Trails in the Sky, I believe it was called. That was an anime movie, and from what I, from what I understand, it also kind of takes part in the same year as Trails of Cold Steel does. Um, I'm thinking to myself, this could have been made into a, a regular series if they really, really wanted to. I'm pretty sure that fans out there are probably screaming about it that they do. But what do y'all think? Y'all think this should be a series? Comment below. Prologue, the depths of despair. Doesn't do. That does not sound appealing. Oh, here you are, Elise. I wasn't expecting to find the two of you together. Well, it's quite cold outside, so I thought I'd come and give Celine some warm milk. <sighs> I keep telling her that she doesn't need to go out of her way for me, but she won't listen. The steam here is plenty to keep me warm. Oh no, that wouldn't do at all. You saved my brother's life. At least allow me to try and make your stay here in Ymir a comfortable one. Celine saved my life? And when exactly did this happen? <laughs> I told her nothing of the sort. I keep trying to tell her it's not true, but she won't believe a word I say. Um, is something the matter? Nope, not a thing. I'd really rather you didn't act like I saved his life, though. Besides, if anything, I should be the one who owes you. What do you mean? N 
nothing. Forget I said anything. The milk's cooled down a little now, so I'm going to have some. Thank you. <sighs> Thinking back on it, didn't Elise later say she spotted a cat when she went into the old schoolhouse? That better not have been who I think it is. Don't give me that look. I wouldn't have let her in there if I didn't think it was safe, you know? I was desperate. You just had such a half-hearted reaction to that door, so I started getting him. I can't believe you! She could have... She wasn't in any danger, honestly. The Guardian in there was designed not to attack people unrelated to the trial. It didn't touch her even when she was right in front of him, right? That's proof enough. I'm sorry, okay? I never should have done it to begin with. Emma's lectured me over and over about it, too. You're sorry? You... Uh, um... I'm not sure why you're whispering to one another, but regardless, I want you to know how much I appreciate what you did. Like I said before, I want to make your stay a comfortable one. Whatever you need, please don't hesitate to ask. It's okay, really. And... Um... Sorry. Hmm? Why are you sorry? Well, she does genuinely seem to regret what she did. And at least didn't come to any harm. I guess I'll let her off this time. <laughs> I really do have one amazing little sister. Compared to her, my... If you've come to thank me for saving your butt again, save it. I'm just glad I made it in time. Princess Alphen and that sister of yours are the ones you should be talking to. You were on their minds this whole time. Yeah, I can tell. I really do appreciate you coming for me, though. I was pretty far out from town, so I didn't think anyone would find me. Just goes to show what bracers can do, I guess. About that. I wasn't actually the one who found you. You weren't? Two days ago? I got a call out of nowhere on my Arcus. They gave me this crazy amount of detail on exactly where to find you, then they just hung up. Didn't even say who they were. I figured it couldn't hurt to go take a look. And sure enough, there you were. Hmm, that's strange. I wonder who it was. Hmm, who indeed? I wish I could tell you. I couldn't even recognize their voice. Hmm, nah, that's not really true. It was kind of familiar, maybe. Eh, whatever. No use dwelling on it. Right now, we've got bigger problems to tackle than mystery callers. There's the war, for starters. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Have you and the rest of the guild been doing much? Well, we've been trying. We're pretty limited on what we can do, partly because we've all been split up since the war broke out. I don't even know if any of the others in Erebonia are okay, Sarah included. It sounds like things have gotten even more serious since I was away. Sure has. Not even regular civilians have been able to escape being affected by it. As it stands, the Noble Alliance has the overwhelming advantage, but the Imperial Army showing no signs of surrendering to them, particularly in a few regions across the country. Hmm. I see. Oh, and another thing you might hear. We've been getting reports of a few Jaeger Corps taking part in the war too. Even members of Ouroboros. Boros, that secret society? That's the one. Jaegers being employed here in Erebonia is nothing new, but there's way more of them here these days. As for Ouroboros, they're probably just trying to stir up trouble of their own. It's what they do best. Then there's the fact that Erebonia isn't the only place with problems right now. Crossbell's full of them too. There's so much to freak out about these days, it could drive you insane. Sorry, you've got enough on your plate without me dumping all this on you, huh? Try saving all those bad thoughts you got piling up for another day. <laughs> <laughs>
okay? You need to focus on relaxing. You can decide what you want to do after that. Um, sure. Thanks, Toval. You're probably right. You're just a fountain of good advice, huh? <laughs> I've just got a few years worth of life experience on you, that's all. Oh, and while I'm giving you good advice, why not take a dip in the hot springs? Could be a nice way to clear your head. <laughs> it probably would. Hasn't let me down before. Maybe I should pay a visit to the Phoenix Wings later. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I think we will end it there. Hope you enjoyed what, what you saw. Um, please, again, click like, click that subscribe button if you like what you saw. Uh, if not, if not, I'll probably do some more of this. Um, let's see much time down the line. Um, sorry, it's been a while for me broadcasting. I'm trying to get some, still just get some stuff together. Anyway, you guys have a great night, and like always, stay up.